Okay, so as promised, I'm going to do the umbrella shape for this video, okay? Because I know sometimes it's one of those tricky shapes. Um, okay, so I'm going to first make sure that I don't have any fill and I just have some kind of stroke, okay? Doesn't matter how thick, I'm gonna make mine a little bit thicker so you can see it. Um, and I'll zoom in a little bit more, but just so you know. So the first thing I'm gonna do is gonna pick up my regular pen tool and I'm gonna make a point, so click. Then I'm just estimating with my eyes Kind of like how, like this, like a, the top of my umbrella. And I'm going to click once there, and I'm going to continue to drag it. Okay. I'm going to let it go. And so right now I've got this much of my umbrella. You guys see that? And since the natural tendency of my pen tool is to go in a round shape. Do you guys see that? I'm going to do the other, just it's following my mouse, my cursor. I'm just gonna kind of go over here and I'm gonna click once, okay? And I don't want it to keep going around in a circle. I actually want to tell the pen tool to change direction so it could make the scallops, okay? So, I'm going to click once in that same spot. Then I'm going to try to start to make my way across, right? So I'm going to go over here. It doesn't have to be equal increments, but I'm just going to eyeball it. I'm going to click and drag. Okay? So the moment I click, I do not let my mouse up. Like the click, it stays down. And then I drag. And the dragging allows me to shape the scallop of my umbrella. When I let go, that shape will be what is um, what you see. Okay, so I'm going to let go. Here's that shape. I'm going to go back here. And I'm going to repeat. I'm going to change direction. Tell the pen tool to change direction, indicated by those little, that little triangle. And I'm going to click once, okay, and I'm going to go to my next spot, click, don't let go, and drag. So I'm continually, I clicked, I didn't let my mouse up, and I'm dragging it so it's the shape that I want. And I'm going to go back and I click once. Click and drag. Click once. Click and drag. Click once. Click and drag. So I always go back to that first point so it closes the shape. If your shape isn't closed, the pen tool is still going to follow your cursor around, okay? So that's how you make the umbrella top. If you got that, congratulations. If you didn't, that's okay. You're not alone. But if you um, are like, okay and you feel confident about your umbrella you know shape you've been able to kind of at least start to figure out how the pen tool works in like creating a shape changing directions um closing the shape is very important um and then what you can do next is you can start to embellish your umbrella. So you can you know, put a fill in, 
if you feel very daring, why don't you pen tool a, uh, a handle for your uh, umbrella there. Doesn't have to be perfect. But I think it'll be very good practice for you to make a shape that uh, is custom to you. That is closer. And you can fill that umbrella handle shape with a color. Right, you can see that the handle is above or in front of that umbrella shape. So, what do we do? We can select it and we can arrange it, send to back. If you want to make that handle a little bit bigger, you can, or you can make that go a little bit bigger. Or two, right. So, save and continue on.